everyone, welcome back. If you're new, welcome. Today we're gonna to be talking about storing our larger Planner Kate sticker so sheets. I have talked about my Planner Kate storage system for quite a while. Um, you know that Planner Kate offers these albums that fit her standard size um, sheets of stickers. And then she also offers this mini size album, which holds her mini sheets. However, I have several larger sheets like these dashboards and the Daily Duo 7x9 headers with the dates that don't fit in either of those binders or albums. So um, I did pick up this 8x10 photo book on Amazon. I'll put a link for you and I'm going to set it up today with my larger sticker sheets. Let's get the stack out of the way first and get this opened up. So now that's out of the packaging, I can kind of tell you um, what the material is. If you are familiar with the Planner K albums, it feels like that same plastic material. It's um, going to protect your stickers, but it's not super hard. There is a little bit of flex to it. It does have this um, opening in the front, a sleeve, so you can add your own label, which I'm going to do. And then it has... Um, several sheet protectors in the middle and they open at the top for you to slide your sticker sheets in. So let's go ahead and make the cover. I have this that came um, on the packaging. I have a piece of white linen cardstock. I will link this below as well. It just has a nice texture to it. I use it for a lot of um, my scrapbooking or memory keeping projects. Um, but I'm going to go walk over to my paper trimmer and just trim that down to the same size as um, the packaging. I have that trimmed down now so I can throw that away. And then this is one of the Planner Kate sticker logos. Um, I think I got it as a freebie. I'm just going to use that to label the sheet and I'm going to put that right down here in the corner. Another option would be to buy um, Kate's large binder labels and, and use those. Um, I just thought this was kind of classy looking. And then I will insert that maybe into the front cover. Okay, so now that's in there, that looks pretty good to me. And then we can start adding our stickers to the sleeves. Let's go ahead and start with these monthly dashboards. Um, I have January through December, and I'll put those in back to back inside the sleeves. Now that that first set is in there, you can see this is an eight by ten book, and the sheets aren't quite eight by ten. Um, but that doesn't bother me that it's not exact. You know, you have a couple of inches on the top and maybe an inch on the side. Um, but I will go ahead and fill up the rest of the book with these. Okay, so I have January through December in here. And now we're going to add in the Daily Duo kit. As I was going through, I found this binder label set that I'm going to keep in here and my word of the year sheets from Planner Kate are going to go in here as well. Time to add the Daily Duo sheets. I just have them in order by kit or mini kit number. All right, I have all of those in, again, in order. And then I did want to show you, because I know you guys are going to ask, if the larger Erin Condren sticker sheets fit in here. And the answer is yes. These came in my launch day order. And I'll show you how those fit. I think they're about the same size as the Planner Kate larger sheets as well. Yep, perfect right. fit. That is a look at this um, new album from Amazon and how I'm going to be storing my Planner Kate stickers. I will probably end up picking up another one of these um, just to have on hand when this one gets full for my Planner Kate stickers. And then I'll probably end up picking up another, a third one 
so that I can put all of my larger Erin Condren loose sheets in here as well. Um, I think it's, I wanted to try one though. I ordered just one so I could see if I liked it and how it worked and the quality of the material and everything. So um, I hope that gave you guys an idea on maybe how you can store some of your larger sticker sheets that don't fit in a traditional mini binder system. If you guys have questions about anything, please feel free to ask. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you back next time.